Dysfunction is a disease. Dysfunction is a disease. It is a disease of the mind. It is a disease of the heart. It is a disease that infects everything and everyone that comes within its purview, its parameters. Dysfunction is a disease that takes us off the right path that takes us out of our true being. Dysfunction is a disease and while most of it is learned, learned behavior, learned beliefs, learned thinking, learned ways of being, it is our responsibility to see where our dysfunction is in our thinking, in our speaking, in our living, and then take responsibility for bringing that dysfunction into normalcy, into the natural way of being. But we are so busy blaming others for why we do what we do, the way we do it, that we don't take the opportunities that are available to us to own and heal our own dysfunction. Instead, we manage it. We manage anger instead of healing it. We manage poverty and lack and limitation instead of eliminating it. But there's always more always more for us to think about, always more for us to be. If you have the disease of dysfunction in your marriage, in your family, in your work life, in your finances, in your body, if you have an organ that's dysfunctioning, if you have a person that's dysfunctional, if you have a relationship that isn't functioning at its highest capacity of love, there's more for you to do within you to get that healed up, to get that disease healed and cured. There's always more. And it's not about more of the outside. It's about more of the inside. Because there's always more you can do to bring yourself into alignment with the truth of who you are. It's just more.